lights. Just a slight little lift. And let's get it! This is gonna look so good in the replays, oh my goodness. Everybody. Welcome back today guys to the channel Gran Turismo 7 for our third and final upload for today If you guys missed any of the previous uploads make sure you guys go ahead click the link in the description box down below in the morning episode We talked about drifting. Uh, it was a little bit interesting. Uh, it looks a little bit weird on the controller I wanted to test this on the wheel for today for the very first time Of course dad joke before we start coming from Divco last episode and he goes what happens when you get slapped by high frequency it hurts with the Z right? Z, okay, right? I like that one. Huge thanks for watching. Leave me your dad jokes down below. Our very first drift build for tonight. I'm excited for this one, man. Huge thanks for watching. And of course, don't forget to slap that like button. Now, I did recently pick up the S13. Now, this thing was actually really clean. I did a little build on there, added some wheels, maybe a window sticker or two. Um, however, you can't throw any window stickers on the actual window or the driver's side or passenger side windows. I thought that was a little bit interesting. Only on the back windows um, and the back window, I do believe, and the front banner. So it's not exactly uh, what I thought it was going to be, but hey, we have window stickers. I'm not complaining any means whatsoever i'm just saying right it's just it's a little weird it's probably safety right it's safety now i do have six gifts in my inventory at the moment i'm going to leave those to spin them all in one episode if you guys would like to see that let me know down below but we're going to be going in to some of the tuning parts here for today I already put a little bit of money into this for the career mode so i've been kind of driving this around and it's been a great car uh, but it's time to do a few more upgrades here. hopefully we get the angle kit in here i do believe extreme is it oh hydraulic handbrake nitrous we have everything Steering angle adapters, hydraulic handbrakes on here, which are actually not bad. $2,500 for that. Nitrous, though, a hundred grand. Um, excuse me? We have racing heavy, wet, intermediate tires. We have a new engine, new body. So many memories going through cars back in the day on GT1, and here we are in full HD on GT7 throwing upgrades on our car. I love it. Okay, so I'm, I'm going to probably grab the hydraulic handbrake. I don't know... Special part for drifting to make the back end slide easier. Do we not already have a handbrake, or is it going to actually put in the hydraulic handbrake. I'm very curious. We don't, we don't really need it. Okay, yeah, oh, we don't, yeah. Provides excellent braking power while also adding some visual flair to your car. The color of the calibers can be customized in GT Auto. I'm not gonna do the nitrous system yet. I'm gonna save that for another build. I am gonna throw on the racing muffler, uh, which is now gonna give us, we have 150 horsepower. We need to bump this up. Damn, you can stroke up, I didn't know that. Engine balance tuning. Okay, that's six horsepower, 2000, thank you. I think we're gonna need that. Oh, no, no, I don't, I don't think we need that. Fully customized suspension, which I don't think I have on here. So, throw that on. Thank you. Brake balance controller we don't need. Active LSD controller. Fully customized racing transmission, which wouldn't be a bad idea. Where's my comfort hards? I need comfort hards on here too. Is that still the main go-to tire? I'm, I'm not 100% sure if that's what everyone's been using, but we're going to stick with what people have been using. That's comfort hards. I don't know if it's changed or not. If you guys can let me know in the uh, comment section. Racing manifold, boom, 163, right? Bore up. Superior cost performance, let's go for it. $4,500, we grab that. High lift cams, so bring us up to 180 horsepower. High compression pins to 191. We're not moving very far though, that's the one thing I'm noticing. This is gonna be interesting. I don't know how this first build's gonna go. We may not even be able to drift. This thing, GT Auto, I am gonna change the paint of this car. I think I'm in the wrong section, aren't I? Oh, wide body, I totally forgot about the wide body. Okay, yeah, let's wide body this as well too. Preview. Ooh, it looks clean. It's only 5,000. Bang! You can hear it in the controller as well, too, man. I love this game. Love this game. And it looks damn good, too. Look at that. Damn. Okay. I do want to throw on a quick paint on this, though. Paint color. Metallic. And, of course, we can't really see anything. We just get to see what's on the Supra, which is interesting. I don't know why they've done that, but... $2,000, we'll throw that on. Color history as well, too. Special colors. We have fluorescent. Oh, my goodness. That's damn. <laughs> that's crazy. Then we have the mat. I'm going to go with the mat that I picked up here. Boom. Okay. Oh, we can do the different colors out of here, too. Body 2. What is this for? Oh, that's the hood. We'll black it out. Why not? Uh, side mirrors. We'll keep body color. Roll cage. I'm going to make this yellow like the endless sticker that's in there. Bang. Oh, the stripe. Hey, okay. 
Okay, let's bring it back to scuba. We're gonna go here with a little drift trial. Okay, here we go. Now I have tilted the wheel down a little bit as well. So we're gonna see how we can do it. Look at the smoke! Oh, damn, I can barely even see. Okay. <laughs> First impressions of the smoke. I am a huge fan here. We got the Thrustmaster TGT. Ooh! I did that on purpose. That 360 was on purpose. We'll actually try to get a little drift here. Oh, I dropped the gear. Shit. I didn't mean to do that. A lot harder, but man, really enjoyable though. I'm on six force feedback, I do believe. Let me just check my force feedback here before I lose it here. Settings, uh, control, oh yeah, we're on six. Okay, so six is feeling pretty good. Really nice replay angles too, so I'm gonna try to get a really nice run here. We will be doing a lot of drift builds on the channel for sure in these next few days, so really excited about that. If you guys have any cars that you'd like to see done, leave it in the comments. Chit! Nice and easy with it, nice and easy. Can't see, can't see. Oh my god, I love how the smoke drags out with you. Huge fan of that. Yeah, no, okay. Second gear said, I don't want it. Ooh. I am a huge fan of the new smoke. The drifting, I don't know, it's it's same, same, but different. I mean, we have the angle kit now, so that's a huge thing. I dropped the gear again, the wrong gear. Damn! High angle, high angle, oh! Yeah, I got it. Right. Yeah, yeah. How's it looking here? Oh, just a smoke show back there. I love it. I guess we're gonna get one more corner here too. This is gonna be wild. Oh, come on! All right, here we go, here we go. Yeah. Hey! No, no. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Seems like we're gonna have a good year this year for drifting. Uh huh. Keep it on, keep it on. Oh, I like this a lot. Oh my goodness. Let me know your honest thoughts down below on the drifting this year. I'm gonna try it in third person here. Or first person, sorry. No, 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 no. Yeah, these comfort cards are definitely the move again this year. They feel great, once again. No complaints. Just a slight little lift. This is going to look so good in the replays. Oh, my goodness. Come on. Okay. Bang. 17,276. Do we got to go all the way to the start finish? I guess so. Let's try to do this properly here. Uh, as I hit the wall. That's not proper at all. And I rhymed again. I'm getting good. Off at 360. Let's go! Smoking hot. 17,276. Excited to watch this replay, man. Let's see the smoke in the full cinematic experience here. Gran Turismo 7 overachieving in everything so far, man. Look at it! We've got our roll cage, our customization, our wheels, our tune, our upgrades. Oh my god, man. I cannot wait 
to get online with GT7. This game is truly stunning and a piece of art, man. As always, every single year Gran Turismo drops a game. It's art. It's not just a game, right? This is a beautiful piece right now and uh, really enjoying this. I'm excited to get through the car list, get some builds going, tuning, upgrades, test the wheel out, right? There's a lot to do here, man. Am I going to go GT Sport mode this year with racing or am I going to drift? And by the feel of these cars right now, I'm going to be doing just as much drifting as I am going to be doing racing because it just feels good. It just works on the wheel. I like it a lot. Let me know your thoughts down below. Drift? Yeah, come on. I love this game. I, the smoke doesn't get any more real than this, I feel like. It's it's nice and thick, it's cloudy, it's puffy, and it lingers, right? Look at it linger! Yes, GT, man. Guys, kill it. Look at it lingering still back there. Love it, love it. Okay, that was sick. Let's take our car. Right, so we need a differential. Where'd the differential go? Differential, there it is. Fully customizable LSD differential. Thank you. Let's go back to World Circuits here. We also have missions available as well too. So I think I'm going to get at that tomorrow morning. If you guys have not already subscribed, make sure you guys go ahead and do so. We got a lot of content coming in. Drift trial. Oh, no. Time trial. No. Drift trial. Thank you. Actually mess with our differential. I remember from before, 60, 60, 60. So we're going to give this a shot here. See how this goes. Braking sensitivity is at 60. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Oof. Yeah, really finding that perfect balance, the traction, and slipping it out, and then being able to reel it back in. This has been sick. It's been hard to see, but it's been really cool. Imagine getting, you know, six, seven cars in a train. How is one supposed to see the other? <laughs> oh, I'm so excited to test out online. It's insane. Big combos. I feel like my tires about to just blow up here, it feels like. I can barely even see where I'm going. We're holding 22k. Come on now. Hey! One more. We're still gaining a little bit. 25,000! We get this new camera angle. This is cool. Oh, it actually rotates with them. What? Now, I guess because of the fact that I was paddle shifting, he's on paddles? How come he's not using the shifter? Oh, that's cool. That is really cool. I'll go there. Yeah, look at it, man. We got a little bit of tuning to do. You can see it's a little bit wobbly back there, but a little bit more power would probably go a long way. Would also make it probably a little bit more shakier, but damn, man, I'm impressed. There's a lot that could be done in this game, and uh, we're just at the tip of the iceberg. There's so much to do on GT7. It's insane. So much here. I'll see you guys back here tomorrow. Let me know your first impressions, your first initial thoughts here on the drifting, and uh, what you want to see next on here on the game, man. Let me know. Huge thanks for watching. Subscribe with post notifications for everything Gran Turismo 7. I'll see you guys back here tomorrow. I'm out. Peace.